All right, Shalom, Barakatai Yahweh, Barakatai Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone. Peace and salutations to the elect who are being assembled. All right, and we're almost at the end of this thing, man. Assemble back to the Heavenly Father for the real royal wedding, which is the marriage of the bride, all right, of the Lamb. Back to the Heavenly Father, man, through the sacrifice made by His only begotten Son, meaning we will be at one again with the Father, with the Creator. We will be where we in, were intended to be, all right, as uh, servants and priests, all right, of the Most High, man. And it's beautiful. It's beautiful to see this thing happening, man. Okay? Because from the beginning, all right, with the family line of Adam, they were given the righteous ways, man. Okay? The tree of life, which is this truth, man. The, the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding, all right, of righteousness, of life. All right? In which this world lacks life, man. Everything is, is centered around death. Um, very demonic day, very demonic time. I know a lot of brothers are vexed in the spirit, but that's only in the flesh and the spirit where we have high hopes. We're fasting, we're praying, and the Heavenly Father is revealing a lot to us, man. You know, brothers don't get caught up in numbers. There's a lot going on that we don't know about, okay? And we're supposed to be a people of faith. Okay, not a people of what we see. Okay, we do see the prophecies coming to pass. We do see that the Heavenly Father is coming through on His promise. Now, this was a uh, message that was sent to me by uh, Rakaya, Rakaya Kwam, brother from uh, the London camp, GMS Fear the Most High Seven. He sent me this earlier, and I spread it abroad to brothers, you know, and it, and, it, and, it, and, it, and it sent joy into brothers' spirits, man. Hey, the Lord is doing a mighty work, man. You know, and we here at Great Millstone, we, we believe that all we need to do is preach this word. We don't need to try to get extra fancy. All we need to do is preach, man. And through the preaching of the word, there's very, very, a very, very high level energy and power that comes with that, man. And all right, we're going to do, all right, the Lord is going to come through on his promise. So all it takes is preaching it, man. Preaching this message, man. So call Halal Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Now this message uh, is from a guy, Josias Mickey Mabe. Okay, it says, Shalom, brothers, all praises and blessings to the Most High. All right, and double honor to the elders like yourselves. If it wasn't for brothers like GMS, some of us wouldn't have come into this truth, okay? It says, down here in South Africa, I watch your videos and they are all edifying. You see that, brothers? Our works aren't going unnoticed, man. Okay, of course we know the angels are watching, but this word is going out, man, you know? And a mighty work is being done through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. Okay? Like, I'm going to go into, uh, Lord willing, today or later or whatever, however it happens. We're all walking miracles, man. This is a miracle that's happening right before our eyes, man. We ourselves coming out of condition that we've left from, you know, looking at the things that happened to our nation. Drugs, scattering, you know, discombobulated, mental mind fuckery, you know, witchcraft, you know. The, the, the chemical warfare, the mental warfare, the info warfare, the move, removing of the landmarks, beating our language out of us, stealing us, stealing our lands, dividing our families, and to still have a remnant come together in these latter days. You can't tell me this is not a miracle, man. So, brothers, you're a miracle, man. Okay, brothers who have taken unto this truth and are serious about it, even you who are listening to it and repenting and coming back to the Heavenly Father, man. You're a miracle, man. And the, pro and, the, and, the, and the miracle is prophecy. It's not of us. It's prophecy because it was prophesied that this would happen, man. Okay? So it says, down here in South Africa, I watch your videos and they're all edifying, man. Bring them on. This is indeed the, the Most High doing his things through the elect like GMS. Lord willing, we have the elect. All right? 
But we understand the sentiment and the water, you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. But we hope that we're of the elect, you know. It says, Barakata Yahweh Bashim Yahshai Shalom. All right, and shalom to this brother. You know, I don't know if you see this video or not, but hey, through the spirit, we're all linked anyway. Um, so I just want to get a scripture, man. You know, because the brother Amawan Gabar did a beautiful video, and he said it's called Esau is too late. Okay, and it is too late, man. It's, it's it's too late. All right, the prophecy's already written, man. All right, you you you're scrambling around the planet Earth. You know, trying to complete your new world order. You're getting ready to move on a minute of the Lord. Shutting down brother's pages. You know, doing little weirdo stuff with brother's thumbnails and history. You know, it's too late. You know, the bottom line is prophecy is on your ass, man. And, and the water, Yahweh Bashim Yahushua, that our, our fight is not of the flesh, man. Our fight is of the spirit. The weapons of our warfare are not carnal. We're pulling down strongholds. See, all we're doing is going out on the street corners, sitting, you know, uh, in our rooms or wherever we're at on break, lunch break, uh, uh, 15 minute break, whatever it is. And we're just doing lessons, going out on the highways and byways and we're prophesying. All right. That is likened unto a sweet savor unto you. How about Shemiah Shai, man? So and the Lord loves beautiful smells and this truth coming out in its purest form. All right. It's likened unto a sweet savor, man. Okay, and that and that's the sacrifice. Us making our bodies a living sacrifice and preaching this word is a beautiful savor, man. And eventually, all right. And what's happening is the angels, all right, are bringing our prayers up to Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai is taking our our prayers and being a lawyer for us. All right, pleading our cause because we were divorced, man. We 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 really should have been left for dead, man. We don't deserve this platform. We don't deserve as a nation to uh, have a right at repentance but it's a promise that was made and the heavenly father's coming through on that promise okay men break promises the heavenly father ain't gonna break this promise and this whole world vocab malone the christian community even israelites are trying to say that this covenant ain't ain't with just us okay some of them are saying they ain't no it ain't, it, we ain't the people at all and saying that the people over there in the Holy Land are the so-called Jews. Prophecy doesn't fit them. See, prophecy is where we win, all right? This is Matthew 24 and 14. And this gospel, all right, of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations. And then shall the end come, okay? And the end is coming, okay? This gospel is being preached amongst all nations via the unicorn, via the internet you have a lot of people who scoff all right that the internet will be mentioned in the holy scriptures man when it's the when when, when the internet is the most powerful tool of our day not only is it, it is the word being preached through the internet all right but you have exposing going on esau can't hide the way he used to hide esau can't do his things in secret the way he used to do because of this powerful tool created by the heavenly father because everything is created by the Heavenly Father. So the scoff that the internet is mentioned in the Bible is crazy. All right? The unicorn, man. How could you scoff at that when this is how you woke up? This is how you waking people up. You see? The internet is a very, very important tool, all right, in this work, man. And it wasn't created for you to, uh, you know, get on, get on the internet and shake your ass. Or, or get on here and show you and your dogs or, you know, uh, uh, highlights of, of the Warriors game. It wasn't created for that. All right. It, it, that's there, but that's a part of the distraction. And more people are going to flock to that. But this Internet was created for this truth to go out. Because if you think about it, brothers, think about this. The men that you're the closest with in these latter days right now, you met them all off YouTube. <laughs> You're, you're traveling the world to meet up with brothers that you saw preaching on YouTube, the apostles and elders. We go travel to see them, which Lord willing, uh, GMS Dallas will be down in New York, man. Really soon, all right? Lord willing, through the Spirit, throw up a prayer for us, man. It's hard times for brothers, but, you know, we we, we going to try to get down there, man, because we know the end is near. 
you know so we got to make that visit all right but hey if it don't happen hey may the lord have us all see each other on the chariot man because we looking for two months down the line total chaos destruction and this thing going down we 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 ain't got no plan for the long run here man all right but if that can happen and we're still here in this flesh baba kashat throw a prayers that it happens man miss those uh mr apostles and elders but you the, the 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 majority of the the brothers that you that are around you all of this linking you know it's, it's all started on youtube the internet how crazy is that now go tell somebody this story man the the, the brothers you the closest with y'all met off youtube people will think you were crazy man but that's the work and power of Yahweh about Shemiah Shah. See, this thing is peculiar, man. See, the, the, the awakening and the, and the truth, the elect coming together is going to come together in a way that nobody would ever think. That's why the Lord said, Behold, all right, ye among the heathen, I will work a work in your day, all right, that even though I told you, you wouldn't believe it. If you telling people that the gathering of the elect, the sealing of the 144 and all of that is happening through youtube primarily because you have people who don't have internet who are still teaching this word don't get me wrong but the but 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 people are coming in, into the this truth through the preaching of the word all right let me read this again and this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world and you don't have to travel okay now if you do travel and you go preach the word more power to you you're not wicked but we, we, you don't have to travel. All you need to do is put the energy out there, man. This is a vibration. And through that vibration, the, the, the people who are uh, uh, chosen from the foundation of the earth to be drawn to it, they go come to it, man. You got to have faith, man. That's why we have to be a people of faith, man. Like Apostle Kabar said, it's, a, it's a, a big voice for a small crowd. You dig? All right, so... This gospel shall be preached in all the, the gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations and then shall the end come. Okay? And amongst all these nations, okay, those that worketh righteousness and come back to the heavenly father, all right, which are Israelites, will be, will be delivered, man. Okay? Lord willing, we're part of that number. Now, let's get Psalms. Let's get Psalms real quick. Psalms chapter 40, one of my favorite, all right, and three, and he hath put a new song in my mouth, all right, even praise unto our God, what is the new song, this truth, man, all right, the, the rights to the tree of life, baby, all right, because death is all around us, but we have a message of life, and it may seem small, it may seem insignificant, it may seem like it ain't reaching uh, 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 the masses Well they ain't supposed to reach the masses man Okay Like uh, Like the guy uh, Judah Natazura You know he was like damn you know He was like damn It's like y'all putting in all of this work But then y'all being overshined By the Israelites throwing concerts Not talking about What's really going on And brother it, it, hey Man you need to come to the true understanding man and then you would understand that this ain't supposed to be uh, uh, meant for 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 uh, the masses, man. Or you can remain in that darkness, okay? Because you're drawn to the videos for a reason. You're seeing that this is the truth. That's what the problem is. But hey, uh, may you come to the understanding, man. Hey, that there's joy when one sinner repented, man. You know, you calling the Messiah a penis and all of that. That's not that's not fruitful, man. And hey, man, the the power you see through us preaching, you're gonna be judged by that power if you don't stop. Okay, so this is a call for Judah not to repent, man. Now, if you worried about how you're gonna look amongst the community or the rest of those guys you with, who they ain't doing no works, the power ain't coming from those uh, 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 Old Testament only guys, Torah only guys, man. And they not even keeping the Torah. Okay. The power is in this message that we're preaching, man, and it ain't of us. But we understand that you see the power. And that power is through Yahweh and the son Yahweh Shai, man. The new song, which when you read this new song right here that we're reading about in Psalms, is also spoken about 
in Revelation the 14th chapter with the 144. Okay? Those are the priests. Because under the order of Melchizedek, we're we're all priests, man. And under the first covenant, you had to be a Levite to be a priest. So how are we all gonna be priests? All 12 tribes. It's gonna be through the order of Melchizedek, which is Yahweh, the first priest, the most highest priest. You dig? Okay? So this is Psalms 40 and 3. And he had put a new song in my mouth, even praises unto our God. The praise of our Lord, the truth, man, it's out there. It's coming out, man. You know? And Satan is gonna lose, man. Satan is taking the L, man. The so-called white man, the Edomites are taking the piss, man. All right? 666 in front of me. You devils are going to lose. All right? To hell with you, Satan. All right? May the most high uh, 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 destroy Satan, man. All right? The adversary. Adversary of righteousness. That's why everything vile is uplifted here, man. Many shall see it. So he hath put a new song in my mouth. Even praise unto our God. Many shall see it. Okay, in fear and shall trust in the Lord. So the new song is going out, man. And many are seeing it and are fearing the Lord. What does fear cause you to do? Repent. Leave off from your wicked ways. Keep the law, statutes, and commandments to the best of your ability through faith. All right, we understand that the laws ain't going to save us, but through faith, all right, we, we keep what laws we can, man, and hope. That we're of that number, man. Okay? He hath put a new song in my mouth, even praises unto our God. Many shall see it in fear and shall trust in the Lord. And that's what you see happening, man. All right? And that that uh message was a message of comfort, man, from that brother in South Africa, man. Because, man, it's been a long time coming, man. This is the day we looked for, man. This is the day that all of our forefathers cried to the heavenly father when it was coming man at the time of acts you know our forefathers when 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 the messiah was there it was like is you go you will restore the kingdom all right but it wasn't time now is the time you know now is the time brothers okay so that's why you see all right many of the house of israel awakening to this truth man all right. It said once this message went out into the ends. All right. Then the end will come. And don't you see the end coming? Don't you see World War Three uh, uh, breaking out on a large scale? OK, don't you see this truth going out exponentially? Don't you see the brothers starting to get into fasting and praying? Joel said that the, the, the Joel said return to the Lord with weeping and fasting. And that's what we're doing. And through that. The energy is going out. The men of the Lord are being sealed and the end is on its way, man. So I just wanted to bring that out to let brothers know, man, our words ain't going on deaf ears. It's going to who it's supposed to go to. As Yahweh Shai said in John, the 10th chapter, we'll end it off on that. Got to get to camp. John, Salakia. All right, this is John chapter 10. All right. And four. All right. I start at one. Verily, verily, I say unto you, he that entered not by the door into the sheepfold, but climbed up some other way, the same as a thief and a robber. But he that entered in by the sh door is the shepherd of the sheep. And that's the true servants, man. The ones who are preaching his word, man. And sincerity and truth, bringing it out. All right. Guiding the sheep. To him, the porter open it. Okay. And the sheep hear his voice. And he calleth his own sheep by name and leadeth them out. And when he put it forth his own sheep, he go up before them and his sheep follow him for they know his voice. All right. And how, what is his voice? That new song, man. And a stranger they will not follow, but they will flee from him for they know not the voice of strangers. Okay. Uh, but this parable, Yahweh spake Yahweh unto them, but they understood not. All right. What? things they were which speaking to them see now we understand it all right i'm pretty sure he expounded to them but now we get it all right the sheep are going to hear the voice man they ain't going to follow a stranger so you know to people one like damn you know ain't nobody listening damn you know these other camps got all of these large amounts of numbers but they got gimmicks you know they playing games they lollygagging they lying you know they're calling on jesus 
You know, they're telling our people the law is going to save them. They're not pushing our people to do the work. You got more men with red cups jumping up and down, rapping and screaming than you do men doing videos, right? That's, that gets frustrating, but if you look at it from a carnal standpoint, but in the spirit, you understand that his sheep is going to hear his voice. And no matter where they are, they're going to be called, man, and they're going to hear, and they're going to come back to the righteousness of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. Okay? Then Yahweh Shai said unto them again, Verily, verily, I say unto you, I am the door of the sheep. All that ever came before me are thieves. All that ever came before me are thieves and robbers, but the sheep did not hear them. So the sheep not going to hear and listen to the gimmicks. Maybe you have some sheep that are amongst the gimmicks right now. But guess what? Eventually the sheep are going to wake up to the madness of those gimmicks, man. All right. I am the door. By me, if any man enter in, he shall be saved and shall go in and out and find pasture. Okay. The sheep. All right. At the end of the day. His sheep hears his voice, man. You know, I ain't going to keep going because I got to get to camp. But at the end of the day, man, his sheep will hear his voice. And his voice is going out through his men, which he sent the Holy Spirit to. Okay, the comforter. You can read Revelation, the fifth chapter, to get that understanding. So with that call, hello, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahshai, Bashim, Rakak, Wadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone. Peace and salutation to the elect. Shalom.